Northrop Grumman is an organization created, in this case, the aerospace system sector for advancing human discovery. We have an amazing legacy of projects from the 20s to modern day, from flying around the world to going to space, the first privately manned space flight. We employ a talented group of people here to solve the nation's hardest problems and preserve freedom for the country. It's an exciting time at Northrop Grumman. One of the best things about my job is I get to work with really innovative people from very different fields. By giving people a place to really create and be creative, we're really attracting people that are either interested in the maker movement or already really into it. Fab Lab is a community resource for Northrop Grumman employees to come and prototype, develop their skills and talents, and to learn about new technologies for making things. When I'm working on my quadcopter projects, we have this space where I can innovate and be creative and have all the tools that allows for rapid innovation. Well, we're hoping that these quadcopters might have a hand to help out in wildlife conservation, to help wildlife conservancies monitor endangered species. Here in Northrop Grumman, we had to use a tremendous amount of creative engineering to develop a machine like the James Price Space Telescope. It's a machine that is the size of a tennis court, and yet it has to be launched uh, into a rocket that is only 15 feet across. For the first time in history, we are looking at other places where life might emerge. The James Price Space Telescope is NASA's first priority for science for this decade. We develop the world's highest resolution, most capable autonomous vehicles. A machine will not get distracted, a machine will not have a bad day, it will not be tired. AccuGoTo is an example. We worked on this for five years. How would one taxi an autonomous vehicle on an airport safely? The technologies and capabilities that we're developing as part of AccuGoTo have a broader impact in any kind of aviation setting, especially in the national airspace. We have a very great team here. Being in the lab and feeling the energy and the dynamic of that is just something that uh, can't be described. You foster creativity by providing an environment for those employees to be comfortable, where they know that their innovation and their creativity matters, and that eventually those things will be implemented in the solutions to those hard problems. We've got this great partnership going on right now with the Crash Pad. We've got this facility for creating, and then we've got a facility for displaying and interacting with the things that have been created. It's really this amazing way to bridge art and engineering. We are designing this side of campus as a downtown space park. It just screams inspiration and it's a hub of creativity. One of the themes here in North of Grumman is Unite. We are partnering with local artists and national artists, schools, universities. It gives the public an opportunity to come in and see what goes on in this company. I met Raul Pizarro through a mutual friend. Raul is an extremely talented painter, but his canvases have been shrinking over time as the muscular dystrophy has been taking away his range of motion. And we're so inspired to be able to help him. So we built him a device that allows him to reach any part of the canvas. You come in here, you've got the people to support you, you've got the equipment, the materials. It's a hotbed for creativity and innovation. At the end of the day, we're working on technologies and capabilities that are game-changing. We're not resting on our history. We need to always be looking forward to innovating and creating. North of Grumman is taking the first, most instrumental and foundational steps to enhance human performance.